In this video, we will solve these five equilibrium shift problems. And for each problem, we'll ask if equilibrium will shift left, right, or have no effect. And so if we increase the temperature, what will happen? Since heat is added, the reaction will shift to try and use up some of the added heat. And since heat is in the product side, it's going to shift left. So the first answer will be shift left. And now we will do the second one. If we increase the concentration of SO2, what will happen? So SO2 is in the reactant. And so if you increase a reactant, it's going to go to the product. And so it's going to shift right. And now for the third one, if we decrease the volume of the container. So we have two moles of SO2, one mole of O2, and then two moles of SO3. So essentially we have three moles of gas in the reactant, and we have two moles of gas in the product. And so if you decrease the volume of the container, it's going to shift to the number that's lower. It's going to shift to two. So it's going to shift right. Had this problem been the other way around, like two moles here and then three moles here, you would go left. And now we will do four. So whenever you add a catalyst, that's the one instance where you will have no effect. And finally for the last one, we are removing or decreasing the concentration of O2. So whenever we remove or decrease something, equilibrium will shift to whatever we're decreasing. And so it's going to shift left. Had this problem said remove or decrease SO3, it's going to shift right. But we had O2, so it's going to shift left for O2. And that's all you need to do for this problem.